and our dear friends, all the Palita School boys and girls. Today, I would like to share with you the words of God, which is very interesting. It's about thanksgiving or give thanks to the Lord. Let us pray. Dear Lord Jesus, thank you for the beautiful day. May you bless us today and be with us. May your Holy Spirit move and touch us, open our heart to know your will and your words. In Jesus' name, Amen. <coughs> today, I would like to read in Psalm 92 and verse 1. It is a good thing to give thanks unto the Lord and to sing praises unto thy, your name, O Most High, to show forth your loving kindness in the morning and your faithfulness every night. So, I just want to let you know that we always say thank you to a person that assists her, us or help us. Let's say we are riding a bicycle and some motorbike hit us and we fell off and then somebody come and help us and we say thank you sir, thank you madam, thank you for helping me. So when we say thank you, we appreciate someone that helped us and then we never thought about something is we never say thank you to our parents we never say appreciate them because they they you know they raise it like they raise us and they bless us so thank you and with thanksgiving and appreciation is very important we must express our get gratitude towards our parents, our teachers, and moreover, towards our God. So, this is what the Bible says that it is good thing to give thanks unto the Lord and to sing praises unto your name, O Most High. Why should we say thank you and appreciate our mom and dad? Because they work very hard to raise us, you know, work and to, you know, to find money and, you know, give us some food on the table and pay our school fees even though we are studying online we must have a good gratitude towards our parents and then to you know to express our gratitude appreciation so again that the lord want us to give thanks unto him do you know that how lucky you are you can still walk you can you 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 are healthy you can hear you should say thank you to jesus you should the bible says that Give thanks unto the Lord. Because there are so many young people like your age, they don't have money to go to school, or they, they got COVID, they have to stay at home. So, today, the devil will stop you and me to give thanks to God. They will say that, oh no, it's, it's a must that the parents work hard to, to, to raise you. Yes, it is a must and responsibility of our mom and dad. But you and me, we should express a good gratitude, appreciate them. So the Bible say that, Oh, for you, O oh Lord, have made me glad through your work. I will triumph in the work of your hand. O oh Lord, how great are you work, and your thoughts are very deep. So today, when you have a problem, you must understand you come to Jesus because his thought is very deep. Because he is the omnipresent God and omnisense, meaning that He is all over the world and everywhere when you pray and He will be there. So today, we appreciate our mom and dad, our teachers. Moreover, we must give thanks and appreciate our God, who we call Him a Savior. His name is Jesus because He died for you and me on the cross. Unconditional love. So today, why we should give thanks to the Lord? Because He died for us, right? So, I just want to share with you very interesting thing is how often that God bless us and we just eat no and we forgot about it and we say that, well, this is just coincidence. No, it is not coincidence. It is the love of God that, you know, the Lord sent somebody to help you. The Lord bless your mom and dad. So, I just want to encourage you boy and girl, today, start today, every morning when you wake up, don't go to have your breakfast or go to the toilet first, but say thank you Jesus, thank you Lord, 
I, I have another day, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I have a good day. So, this is very important. When you express your gratitude to, towards God, you say thank you to Jesus. He will bless you. He will protect you. He will guide you. So, every day before you go to school, remember to sing one song for Jesus. I love you, Lord. So, this will change your whole day. You are going to have a promising day. You are going to have a day that the Holy Spirit will guide your study, will guide your life. I, I know that now you cannot go to school. You're going to study on- online. But it is fine. You Every morning when you wake up, you just say, Lord, thank you for today, Lord. May you grant me a, a sound mind and a good health. May you bless my mom and dad and my school. So this is going to change your life and you are going to see the differences when you give thanks and praise the Lord. God bless you. May the Lord, you know, be with you. Yeah. Remember, study hard, study well. If you have any problems, just close your eyes and ask the Lord to help you. Surely, He will bless you and help you. Let's pray. Dear Lord Jesus, thank you for today. Thank you for remind us that every day, Lord, We must give thanks unto you because you are so good. You love us, Lord. Lord, here we are, all our Palita school boys and girls. We surrender our life in your hand. May you bless our boys and girls in the school, their study online. Bless their family, their teachers. Lord, grant them a wisdom and a knowledge. Thank you, Lord.